uh, Jeff down at the guitar store and uh, doing a series of these videos on choosing a guitar pick or plectrum. And <clears throat> I really suggest you watch the, 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 the I do this is third in the series, the number one and two, because I do those on different types of guitars where you can see the, the first one was on a triple zero kind of auditorium size guitar. It's more finger picking, finger style, and that gives a, a, a difference actually with, the finger, with, these, uh, with these flat picks and, and picks. And then I did with a jumbo size style with more of a maple body. So that gives, a, a, again, another tip of different type of guitar, different format usually for, for the style of playing and the sound and, and go ahead and watch those first and we're going to come to this one. Now here I'm going to cover a 12 string guitar. This is a Dreadnought, kind of a folk western country uh, kind of uh, style of uh, playing guitar. And this is, got a, this is going to have a, a the rosewood is going to be a more wider spectrum of sound than we've seen with the other two guitars. So that'll get a, a, the, the kind of the sound to be balanced more along the ways here. Uh, but it's 12 string, so this is going to really influence the choose uh, your choice of a, of a specific pick. So what I'm going to do is come back again. We've we've got the whole assortment of picks here, and I'm going to start with the very light, light 38, uh, the 38 uh, the millimeter here, and you're going to feel here. So this is this is what you get when you're doing that on a just a. So this is really nice. What you want to play but again? This is just really nice for playing. It's, but that 12 string has got double strings, and usually those are going to be a high, low, high, low, high, low, and down to the last two or the high, high uh, of the octave. Now, when they come to a little bit thicker pick, the 60 around here, uh, same kind of strummy style, same song here. It's going to be a little bit stronger. It's going to project a little more volume. Now, we're going to come to that really thick pick, the one and a half millimeter pick here. Um, and this one, we're going to have to be kind of careful because the, the, the 12 string uh, with a thick pick, you, can, you could risk breaking the strings if you're really stringing hard. So I'm going to, put, I'm going to do the, kind of the same one. It's Uh, some of the highs that we had in the, uh, the earlier ones. I'll come back to that thin pick again and let you hear the difference here. There's... See the difference there? So the, 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 that's the really thick pick. We're losing a little bit out of that when we're coming to that sound. Now let's come to that metal pick. Um, this one, uh, they've got that copper pick that, uh, this one, uh, I played a lot of 12 strings with this for many years, and, and so we're gonna hear, that. what does this give here when you're doing it? Again, a, uh, one that's going to emphasize the highs, like with all the maple guitar and the jumbo. This is again, this is a guitar that's got those double octave here in this song, so those high ones. So it's going to really emphasize the the, the high end uh, highs on that. Uh, now um, I'm going to come back to some. Again, the thin pick is not really good for uh, individual flat pick, you, especially with a big guitar like this, where there's not much space between the the, the strings. And it's really tough. I can do it. Hard to grab those those strings with the with the pick, so I'm gonna come to that middle one again, that 60, and kind of do a little. What does that get with the flat picking? Okay, now I'm gonna come to that really thick pick. Um, what does that give if I'm doing that flat picking type style here, right? It's a little bit easier to go ahead and do the flat picking, but uh, uh, it's going to give a little bit deeper sound to that, and we're going to lose some of those highs. Now let's come to this. This one again, the copper pick is really nice for that flat picking because it's really hard to, to slip. It doesn't slip very well because it's a, my sweat is just actually holding it there, my finger. Uh, and it's going to have a little bit of highs. So what does this one give? Okay. <laughs> This cock 
copper pick, the metal one, is really great because it's emphasizing the highs, which are good for the 12 string. Um, it doesn't slip, and you can grab the strings as you're going playing along. Okay. Now I'm going to come to the, the, the last uh, pick here. Uh, I'm not even going to try to do this little small pick. Uh, it's going to be kind of hard to do though. You can do it, but it's, it's really made. It's kind of, it's a hard to get used to this one uh, unless you play a lot of the, 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 the kind of the jazzy the picking with that one. Now I'm going to come back to the, uh, 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 to a thumb pick. Now, uh, the playing a 12 string uh, for finger style uh, is not always easy for people. Um, I'm pretty good at doing that um, just from years of a lot of doing it. So I'll kind of uh, give it here and I'm going to let you, let, hear you, let you hear what it does for this type of pick in, in a couple different situations. So here I'm going to do this finger plucking type and with maybe some mixing of the finger picking as well. Okay. <laughs> Let's come back to the like I did in the other guitar, where uh, where I can play just with the thumb pick, and um, what does that do? So I'll hear him. All right. So this guitar is really made for strumming. Uh, it's got a, the, it's the, the style of the guitar is. Um, the type of pick, depending on the loudness and the projection you're going to want, is going to determine. And of course, that 12 string with the highs is going to favor anything that's not going to be too thick uh, for strumming. But if you want to do a lot of, if you want to try that flat picking, then you want a little bit thicker. And that metal pick does give, it, does seem to balance both those out to allow the highs to come out plus the, the thickness that allows you to get the, grab those strings. So I hope that helps you with choosing a pick, the different style, different types of guitars. Thanks.